so what's your name and how old are you? My name is Adam Emery, and I'm 24 years old. Where are you from and where do you currently live? I'm from the Bay Area, I guess you could say, Valley at the same time. Born in Hayward, California, migrated to Antigua, California, and I've lived in Modesto, California the last three years. How long have you been skateboarding? I've been skateboarding for 18 years. What's your motivation to keep skating after all these years? Just the pure fun in it. I mean, 18 years of skating, I still feel like a kid every time I jump on the board, man. Just pure fun. Plain and simple. Who got you into skateboarding? My older brother, Andrew. How do you feel about growing up skating contests? Skating contests growing up, I stumbled upon them at the age of 12, and I skated them until the age of 17 as just Little League skateboarding in, in small terms. And then after that, I started doing bigger contests like Mountain Dew and Hometown Heroes and just bigger amateur events, so it doesn't necessarily define my skateboarding. I don't define myself as a contest skateboarder, but it definitely is a big part of my skateboarding. Tell me a little bit about how you got your brace and why you continue to wear it. That goes towards the contest skating. You gear yourself up and train to a certain extent to where you want stuff a certain way. You want to do stuff on point and stay consistent. And I just caught myself practicing too hard before a contest and 20 minutes before Mountain Dew floated pro in San Jose, snapped it and that's how I got the brace. Been wearing it ever since. Why do you continue to wear it? I continue to wear it because I had such an extensive surgery done on my arm that I almost lost it and I don't want it to ever go to that extent again so I feel the need to just wear it. What's your favorite show on TV? Ooh, that's a good one. Most likely South Park. <laughs> How could I not say that? It's too many episodes, man. Too many episodes. So you got a cover in the new Skidmark and a 10-page interview. How do you feel about that? The cover was definitely a surprise. I was super hyped that I even got that photo in general. Had to do that trick twice just to get the photo because the photographer that day, the good friend Christian, he was shooting it actually the other way for someone that was skating goofy footed. And I had landed it already and had to get him to switch other sides. So there was a lot of people on the session that day and I was one of the only ones skating it regular footed. So he was just taking care of it like a photographer would and taking care of all the people that were dominating in the, that stance. So we had to get the angle real quick and I just decided to do it again and luckily that photo was the make. The interview on top of it is something that I've been working on that for a while with Dan. I've just gotten the opportunity for him to come out to the valley and stay with us and actually document a little bit of what we do on a day to day. A little bit of Bay Area stuff, a little bit of Valley stuff, so it shows a little bit of everything. How can people find you on social media? <clears throat> My Instagram is emeryboard, E-M-E-R-Y-B-O-R-E-D. That's my main social media source. I mean, there's a Facebook out there if you want to go look at it, but a lot of cobwebs there, so hit up the Instagram. Wherever you want to put it, if you do that, click places. Maybe right here. <laughs> I see people do that, so I thought I would. <laughs>